a sore head, Joey. I was only teasing. I didn't mean to drop the bat on your head. Anyways, I didn't think it would hurt so much. Oh, yeah? It hurts every time you do it. Today. That's his birthday present, the harmonica. Lenny's a good harmonica player. He's a good baseball player, too. He shouldn't have got no birthday present because all the time he's teasing me. He never even lets me touch his harmonica. That's my kid brother, Joey. Everybody says, couldn't you kiss him? So go ahead, kiss him. Joey ain't so bad. But he's a pain in the neck in the summer on account of my mom works and I take care of him. Boy, am I glad it's Saturday. Joey's smart for his age, especially about horses. He don't hardly think of nothing else. In all your whole life, you never met a kid who happened to be so crazy about horses. Come on, let's play ball. Okay, but anyway, you don't have to grab. Let me play, Lenny. You play with us? Okay, take your gun off. I don't want to take it off. Don't play. I want to play. Okay, come on. Want to take the lick, Lenny? Okay, Harry. I want to be a first. Listen to him. You play in the outfield, Pat. Way out. I'll push. Mom? 
Grandma's very sick for it. I gotta go to her. Is Grandma going to die, Ma? Shut up, you dope. Don't worry, Ma. She'll be okay. I want to be going to Dable. I'll be back tomorrow afternoon. Tomorrow afternoon? You mean you're going today? Yes, dear. I'm making a two o'clock train. But, Ma, tomorrow's... Who's going to take care of Joey tomorrow? You'll have to. But, Mom! Uh, tomorrow's when I'm supposed to go with the fellas to Coney Island. My birthday present. I don't want to take Joey with me. No, dear. Joey can't go to Coney Island. Neither can you. I'm sorry, Lenny, but this is an emergency. Why can't I go, Mom? Why can't Joey stay home alone? I don't want to stay home alone. Lanny, if your father were alive, things would be different. But you're the man of the family now. I don't want to be the man of the family. I want to go to Coney Island with the fellas. You don't want. You want. You think I want to work every day in a department store and stand on my feet behind a counter and come home after and keep house? But I got to do it or we don't eat. And you've got to stay home with Joey tomorrow. Don't look like that. Not such a big sacrifice. You can go to Coney Island some other time. Oh, come on, have your lunch, Lenny. Lenny, see that Joey gets to bed on time tonight. And you stay in with him. Lenny, I'm leaving your shopping list in six dollars. A five and a one. Make sure you get the right change for the five now. Don't forget, count it. And remember, Mrs. Carlson is always home in case anything happens. Rose are red, violets are blue. I can go to Korea and you can too. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I just can't go, that's all. 
Gotta stay home and mind Joey. Oh. My mother went away. I gotta mind Joey. Oh. Hey. Hey, Lenny, look at this. I bet you wish this here was Joey and this was you. Uh, Joey ain't got that much blood. I know how you can get rid of Joey. How? You bury him under the sidewalk and cement it up again. They never find the body. Ah, you'd have to kill him first. Why? It was on the idea. Wait a minute, I got it. We stab with an icicle. So what? They never find a murder weapon. It melts. Well, you're gonna get an icicle in the summertime. I read a good one. The Indians used to do it. We stake Joey on a desert. Then we take a cake of ice with a rattlesnake in it and put it on his chest. Then the sun melts the ice. Ah, uh, more ice? Last night on the television, they made blood come out of a guy's ears. Blood, you dope. That's ketchup. Ketchup? So that's how they do it. <laughs> Change your shirt, Lenny. It's gonna get full of ketchup. Where was you? Why didn't you find me? I looked everywhere, but he wasn't there. I got tired of hiding. Hey, Joey, Harry's got a real gun. A real one? Yeah, he's opened a big lock. Come on. Hey, 
Lenny? Lenny? Operator. Boy, I can't wait to see Joey's face when he sees you, Lenny. Hey, I got an idea. We get some flowers, see? Then we put it on your face. You mean and we like rub a it ghost? In. That's it. Nah, we did enough. I feel kind of sorry for Joey anyway. Hey, my harmonica. I left it back in the lot. Oh, no, you didn't. I gave it to Joey. You what? That's right, I gave it to him. Then he knew you were dead. If anything happens to that harmonica, you pay. Says who? Says me. Aw, oh, fellas. You stay out of this, Charlie. This was all Harry's idea, and I think it stinks. Listen to him. He's all the time picking on Joey instead of picking on anybody that's his size. Well, you're my size. Hey, fellas, I gotta go now, fellas. Hey, fellas, I gotta go.
Perfect. Hold it. Hold it now. Smile. Joey, you can smile. Please. Smile, Joey. Please. Smile. Smile. Smile, Joey. That's right. That's good. All right, same smile. Come on now. Good, good, hold it. I got it. Won't take long, no time at all. Three minutes. My new assistant. Have you seen Joey Christie? Mm, I seen him yesterday. Give me a paw, please.
Okay. Sure, I'm taking good care of them. Don't worry, Mom. When are you coming home? Six o'clock. Tomorrow? Six o'clock. There's nothing wrong, Mom. I told you we're both okay. Yeah. Goodbye.
Here's where you win them. Hip right up, folks. Hip right up. Everybody knocks them down. Three balls, red eye. You can't miss. Win a prize. It's easy. It's fun. And it's only an eye. your hands here, partner. That does it. Say, you're going to be a good rider. Yes, sir. Terrific. I'm going to show you some special things about riding, Willie. And I'll tell you a little story about how I learned to ride. We're going to have lots of fun together, Willie.
Gee, thanks. Thanks again. This ain't no deposit battle. Where's the deposit? Deposit? That's where you get money. Come on. I'll show you. I'll help you. Come on, Joey. Here's the place. Joey. Hurry up. Here comes my brother. Where do you think you're going? How much you get? Twenty-five, but it equals Joey's. You're crazy. It ain't your money, Charles. Come on. Come on, drink the water. Stop wiggling. Come on. Baby. All right. Oh, Sonny, look what you did. Now I have to go all the way back to the fountain for some more. I'll go, lady. That's a nice boy. It'll only take you a minute. Oh. Stop my bottle, please. Hey, mister. Thank you.
back a little bit. Can't you see the man needs air? How did it happen? He was just swimming and all of a sudden he went down. Come on, break it up, break it up. Move back a little bit, please. You know, he didn't even yell for help. Stand there right next to him. I turn around for a minute. I turn back. <laughs> Seven, nine, ten. Hey, Jay! Joey, you back? All right. Oh, hey, you must be one of them Texas millionaires. Tell you what I'm going to do, Joey. I'm going to let you ride on Beauty. He's a special horse.
me a hand with this pony. You like horses, huh, Joey? Yep. You know, if you want to be a cowboy, you've got to learn to do a lot of things. Like roping. Cowboys got to learn to handle a rope. Like this. Come on now, Joey, you do it. Come on, take it. That's it. Now jump through it. Good. Oh, keep going. Atta boy. Another thing, Joey. A cowboy's got to be able to bulldog a steer, too. Watch. good with horses, Joey. How'd you like to work here? Sure. Well, all right, you're hired. <clears throat> hmm. Uh, by the way, Joey, uh, you got a social security card? Oh, of course not. This is your first job. Well, I guess we uh, ought to write to Washington. What do you think? Now, oh, what's your name? Joey Norton. Address? 11 Woodson Avenue. Okay. What do I do now? Oh, uh, you'd hear, you water the pony, uh, over there. Lenny. Joey? Joey? Listen, mister, I'm his big brother. Tell him Lenny's alive. Yeah, alive. And Keaton there. I'll be right over. Coney Island? In the boardwalk? Yeah, yeah, I know the place. Okay. But keep in there. Coney Island. Looks like a good Sunday, Pete. That's right. I'm Lily Norton. Where's my brother? He's not here. Tell me what this is all about. It was it was only a joke. And then you called me on the phone. Look, Lenny, I think you better go to the cops. But my mother will find out. Oh, and maybe I... she will, but you can't let a little kid like Joey wander around Coney Island alone. After all, he's only seven. Now I'm going to tell you how to find the police station. And tell the sergeant to check all the merry-go-rounds and pony rides, because your kid brother's nuts about horses. Yeah, I'll tell him. Thanks. Hey, mister, 
Have you seen a red-headed kid with a cowboy gun? Hmm. Nope, not today. No, Sonny. Uh-uh. No. Not here. Sorry, kid.
What time is it, please? A quarter to four.
only a joke. Why didn't you tell me? Here, Lenny. I wouldn't have took it. I said you was dead. You can keep it, Joey. Till we get home. <laughs> yesterday afternoon. Oh, never mind. <clears throat> Grandma's going to be better. And I tell you what, next Sunday, we're all going to get out in the air. I'm going to take you to Coney Island. Yeah. 